Hi everyone, Daniel here. Despite having my wisdom teeth removed recently, I still want to take the time today to check out the next dock. This laptop shell has a 14 inch screen, a big battery, Bluetooth mouse and keyboard, as well as a few ports. The next dock was designed to be used in conjunction with small devices such as phones, tablets, or even a Raspberry Pi to create an affordable laptop experience. As an owner of a Microsoft Lumia 950, I instantly fell in love with this concept. But how is the next dock in reality? The design is slick and the build quality is fairly decent. The matte finish reminds me of a ThinkPad. The keyboard is better than what I expected. And there are even magnets that hold the two halves closed. On the flip side, however, the screen wobbles quite a bit. The trackpad is nothing short of terrible and the charging cable is absurdly short at only three and a half feet. To use the next dock with the Lumia 950, you'll need the included mini HDMI to HDMI cable, and then purchase an additional USB-C to HDMI adapter. Next computer recommends one from either HP, Dell, or Google. From here on out, the experience is dicey, which is about what I expected. The Continuum feature hasn't gotten any major updates yet, and the next dock is third-party hardware that's trying to serve users other than just those with a Windows phone. Sometimes the mouse input will lag severely, sound won't work, or Continuum mode might not even activate. I think it's also worth mentioning that even if everything seems to be working properly, my Lumia 950 still pops up a USB error 43 notification. And because Windows phones connect to the next dock through the mini HDMI port, the phone won't charge through this connection. With the mini HDMI in port, the next dock can also serve as simply a screen for computers in a pinch. During the Indiegogo campaign, I spent $80 on the next dock, and at the time the company gave it an estimated retail value of $150. Currently on their website, they have the price of $120 shown, but it is unavailable for purchase. I don't believe I can recommend the next dock at any price, however. That's not to say I'm disappointed with the next dock. I wanted to lend my support to this company because I believed in their vision for the future of computing, where our phone is the computer and we simply dock it with a larger screen and keyboard. Regardless of the quality of the hardware, I've yet to see Windows 10 and the Continuum feature at a point where this future can be a reality. Later this year, HP is releasing the Elite X3 and a slew of accessories, including a more premium laptop docking station. While this accessory will undoubtedly be more expensive than the next dock, I'm curious to see how well the Elite X3 handles Continuum given that the accessories are made by the same company. But that's it for me on the next dock for now. If you have any questions, post in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. And if I get enough, I might even do a follow-up video on the next dock. Be sure to hit the subscribe button to see more from me. And of course, thank you all for watching.